everybody, welcome back, unboxing time, and today we got something a little bit different. Uh, it is a mystery, it's not a mystery box, but I'm excited about these. Today we have Titan Vinyls, six blind box Cartoon Network figures. Um, some of these are Hot Topic exclusives, I just realized. Or one is. Uh, does that make sense? I guess, yeah, I bought one at Hot Topic, because <laughs> they had one left, and I uh, bought the rest at Barnes & Noble, it looks like. So, okay, cool. Well, now I didn't know that, so that changes things up a little bit. Although I don't see what the, oh, I see. Okay, well, I'll show you that in a second. So anyways, let me just give you a little look-see around. These are um, Titan vinyls, so they're actually a little bit pricey, uh, but you know, they're pretty cool. So you can get a lot of cool figures in there, a lot of classic, a lot of modern, um, pretty much all shows I love. So I'm gonna be happy pretty much with whatever I get, as long as I don't get too many duplicates or anything. I also really always like the numbering systems. It's like one in 10, one in 20, two in 20, one in 40, all those kind of things. You know, I like the, the variant variances, various variants. Um, also, let me show you that. That's the Hot Topic exclusive one. Hopefully that can zoom in there. Um, I'll have to look at the number in a second, but it's a, it's a special Steven Universe one you could possibly get. And it's one in 20, so that's pretty cool. Okay, well, uh, I guess we just need to start getting in here. I'd love to get that Samurai Jack, but then, uh, come on, Rigby and Mordecai, Eduardo, Johnny Bravo though, man. I, oh, Grim. Oh God, I wish they'd made Billy and Mandy, but they don't. Anyways, like I said, any of these would be really, really cool. I can't remember if Titan Vinyl, if I can feel the bag or not, if they're 10 bags. I think they're 10 bags, yeah. That makes them not as fun for my feeling guess, but I guess I can kind of get in there. Uh, flat head, uh, fat body, flat head, two feet. I'm talking like a real flat head. Um, no, there's, oh, that's an accessory, I guess. Uh, well, who has like a super flat head? Anybody? Hmm, maybe Dexter? That's really about the only one I could I could see that's this is gonna possibly be. So let's see what we got. Uh, how do where, how do you open these things? Oh, this one's already practically open. I believe that is a Dexter. Oh, cool, 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 cool. Oh wait, is this the? Uh... Oh, I think I got the one in forty Dexter too. I I did I did get the one in I did I did. That's not the best Dexter, but it's not too bad I suppose. Because you'll notice it looks like the normal one, the one in 20, he's not all scuffed up and scarred up. So I'm thinking maybe he's that one. So that's really cool. Um, of course the Titans, they do have a little bit of posability and he did come with a little accessory. He's got a, a, a beaker filled with a toxic chemicals, toxic goo here. So he's gonna make the Toxic Avenger or maybe he's gonna start making Powerpuff Girls. But that is really cool. Actually, I love that. I love that a lot, so now hopefully I get a DD to annoy the hell out of him. We're gonna open that Hot Topic one last, by the way. So let's jump in here, because I realized that took forever before I even got started, and see who the next one could possibly be. So we feel around. He has a flat head too, but that doesn't feel like Dexter. He's got like a ponytail. Well, maybe it is Dexter. Crap, I think it's another Dexter. I hope I didn't get like two of the same Dexters. Hopefully at least the different Dexters. We'll find out, won't we? Um, yeah, that's Dexter. Is he different? Yeah, he's different. Oh, cool, so I did. So this is the one in uh, 40? Yeah, the one in 40, Dexter, and this is the one in 20. He does not have an accessory, he's cleaned up. So that's cool, so I got both Dexters. Now I really want Dee Dee. Dee Dee, what are you doing, Dee Dee? Actually, it's, I mean, it's, it's, it's uh, you know, okay, all right, cool. Um, all right, so moving on, number four. Who are we gonna get? Who are we gonna get? This one definitely feels different. This is, this one's sizable. Um, oh, it's got like big, like balls on top of a flat head. I mean, that could be Dee Dee. Let's see, anybody else fit in the Dee Dee mold there? That's gotta be Dee Dee. Oh man, I think I got my wish, guys. I think I just got the whole Dexter's Lab set out of my first three, so that's pretty cool, because Dexter's Lab is one of the old school ones I love. I wish they made Ed, Ed, and Eddie. Oh, I got Dee Dee. If only they made Ed, 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 Ed and Eddie. Oh, she's adorable. She's adorable. Look at that. Look at that, that cute, innocent face. She never causes any trouble, does she? Nah, not Dee Dee. <laughs> Sweet. All right, I got the whole Dexter set right off the bat. Excellent. Okay, Um. cool. Rigby and Mordecai, maybe? That'd be awesome, but I doubt it. Although they are common, common enough it could happen. So let's see. Again, there's still plenty in here I would absolutely love, though. And I certainly love the vintage a little bit more than the current, but you know. Oh, I was just thinking I would love Johnny Bravo. And I'm like, damn sure, I just got a Johnny Bravo. And uh, the question is, is he the two in 20 or is he the one in 40? Let's see, it is Johnny for sure. Oh, he's smiling. Oh, uh, he's got a, a thing, what's he got, what's he got? Oh, his comb, that's cool. That's cool, where's the common one? Uh, I think this is the common one. Yeah, that looks like that's gonna be the common one. 
Uh, but I do love that he comes with a comb for his a ginormous quaff. <laughs> oh, these are great, dude. I want more of these. I really want more of these. But anyways, there's, oh, mercy. <laughs> oh, crap. Maybe that's just because I got his arms out. I hope that's just because I got his arms out. Oh, no, he's top heavy. Well, he works out okay, though. Hey, baby. I want to see my muscles. Anyways, that is awesome. That is awesome. God, well, okay. Am I, am I like psychic today? Because I'm predicting all the ones I want. That's what I get. Grim. I'm going to say I want Grim. So let's see. Let's see what we can get. He's 1 in 20. He's a little bit more rare. Um, ooh. Oh, I think I think I got Eduardo. I'm scared. I don't, I, I can't do him at all. Uh, it's been too long. It's been too long. I really, actually, now I want to go watch some Fosters. It's Eduardo. There is only the one version. Actually, I think it is. Yeah. There is only the one version. Oh, 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 oh. Aw, oh, aw, oh, dude, dude. Why didn't they make blue and stuff though to go with him though? That would be so cool. Ah, uh, he's top heavy. Why are you gonna make him all top heavy? But oh, you know, let me get him where you guys can see him. Jesus, that is nice. That is very, very nice. Hi, oh, there's my hand down there. <laughs> okay, cool, man. Oh God, these are awesome. Except it really sucks that Eduardo does not want to stand up. So we're gonna have to glue his foot to something. I hate that, man. I hate it when they make these things and like they're just not designed or weighted wise. Okay, well, this is a Hot Topic exclusive, but it looks like that Steven Universe is the only exclusive one. And you know, I like Steven Universe, but I still need to watch a lot more. So if I don't get that, I'm fine. As long as I get something cool. I'm probably due for a duplicate, even though I bought this at a completely different store. Interesting. Very interesting. Who has? A pointy head. I was gonna say Uncle Grandpa. Oh, I think I got a Mordecai. Okay. He's two and twenty. Or one and forty, depending on which version. Shame I don't get a Rigby too though, but let's see. Let's see which one we actually got. Figure out how to open it. There we go. It is definitely Mordecai. It definitely looks like the common Mordecai, but whoa! It's still very, very cool. Um, you know who you know who else likes Mordecai? My mom! Um <laughs> anyway. Now I'm gonna go watch some regular show. Of the modern cartoons, regular show is hands down my favorite. I just, that show is my kind of weird. Plus they reference so many of the great movies from my youth, you know, all the Evil Dead stuff and everything. So there you guys go. There's the uh, Titan Vinyl uh, Cartoon Network collection is what this is called. I want a bunch more of these. I really want a bunch more of these. I want this whole collection. I definitely need a Rigby now. Uh, I really, really want Grimm. I think he's the one I did not get uh, that I would really like to get. Samurai Jack would be cool too. Gumball, yeah. Um, so anyways, that's what they are. If you can find them, buy them, because they're awesome. Except Eduardo, who doesn't want to stand up on his own. Lame. Uh, but, you know, there you go. Comment away. Let me know. Do you like these? What was your favorite Cartoon Network show? What's your favorite classic one? What's your favorite modern one? What's your favorite everything in between? Um, you know, Cartoon Planet, was <laughs> that was my jam, too. Uh, Courage, the Cowardly Dog. Good Lord. Oh, why is there not a Courage? Um, have you bought any of these? Which ones did you get? Which ones would you most want? All that kind of stuff. Geek out in the comments like we like to do, because there's plenty to geek out about. Other than that, click the thumbs up button. Give me the thumb of encouragement, because I do like to be encouraged. And I guess I'm going to get on out of here, and uh, I will see you guys later. <laughs>